I start my day off with a nice smoothie. And most of the time, all I want to do is just put this in a sink full of water. However, when it comes to a blender, that's not the best thing to do. We do want to fully remove the bottom and get to that blade and that rubber ring because that's where a lot of bacteria and mold can grow. So twist off your bottom. That's piece number one. Pull out your blade so you have your pitcher. And then this blade has a rubber ring. And we want to make sure that we get that rubber ring out. Each piece should be washed uh, separately. So you want to put your blade on the side so you know you're not going to cut yourself. Wash each piece and then allow it to dry. Now if there is mold within your blade, so around the outside this is normally where you'll find it, or on the rubber ring, all you need to do is wash everything with hot soapy water, put it into a sink full of bleach and water, and then allow it to air dry. That way you know it's clean for your next smoothie. For more household tips and tricks, visit atcobluefamekitchen.com.